Have you ever witnessed the raw power of a thunderstorm? It's a truly awe-inspiring event. The sky darkens, clouds swirl, and a sense of anticipation hangs in the air. Then, suddenly, a jagged bolt of lightning splits the sky. A deafening roar of thunder follows. It's a dramatic spectacle, a reminder of the immense forces at play in our atmosphere. These natural fireworks, as frightening as they may seem, are actually fascinating scientific phenomena. Understanding the mechanisms behind these electrifying displays deepens our appreciation for the intricate workings of our planet. So, let's delve into the science behind these captivating events. Let's unravel the mysteries of thunder and lightning. Lightning, in its simplest form, is a giant spark of electricity. It occurs within a thunderstorm, a type of storm characterized by strong updrafts and downdrafts of wind. These turbulent air currents cause tiny ice particles within the cloud to collide. These collisions generate static electricity, much like the static you feel when you rub a balloon on your hair. The storm cloud becomes a giant battery, with positive charges gathering at the top and negative charges accumulating at the bottom. When the electrical potential difference between these areas becomes too great, a massive discharge of electricity occurs. This is what we see as lightning. But what about the thunder that accompanies this dazzling display of electricity? Thunder is the sound produced by the rapid expansion of air surrounding a lightning bolt. You see, lightning doesn't just carry electricity, it also generates intense heat. This heat causes the air around the lightning bolt to expand explosively, creating a shock wave. This shock wave travels through the air as a sound wave, reaching our ears as the familiar clap of thunder. The rumbling sound we often hear is due to the sound waves echoing off the ground, clouds and other objects. Thunder and lightning, while appearing as separate events, are intrinsically linked. They are two sides of the same coin, both products of the same electrifying phenomenon. Lightning is the visual manifestation of the electrical discharge, while thunder is the audible consequence of the intense heat generated by that discharge. This is why we always hear thunder after we see lightning. Light travels much faster than sound. So, the light from the lightning reaches our eyes first, followed by the sound of the thunder a few seconds later. The delay between the two depends on our distance from the lightning strike. The farther away we are, the longer it takes for the sound to reach us. Lightning's Forms – A Visual Symphony Lightning isn't a one-trick pony. It manifests itself in various forms, each with its unique characteristics. The most common type is intracloud lightning, which occurs within the same cloud, typically between the positively and negatively charged areas. Then there's cloud-to-cloud -cloud lightning, a dazzling spectacle where lightning arcs between two separate storm clouds. And finally, we have the most familiar and potentially dangerous type cloud-to-ground lightning. This occurs when an electrical pathway forms between the negatively charged cloud base and the positively charged ground below, resulting in a dramatic discharge of electricity. Shocking trivia. Facts about lightning and thunder. Now let's delve into some electrifying trivia about these atmospheric wonders. Did you know that lightning can reach temperatures hotter than the surface of the sun? That's right, a single bolt can heat the surrounding air to a scorching 50,000 degrees Fahrenheit. And while most lightning occurs within a cloud, about 25% of lightning bolts strike the ground. That's why it's crucial to seek shelter during a thunderstorm. Remember, if thunder roars, go indoors. Decoding the storm, the importance of studying lightning and thunder. Studying lightning and thunder isn't just about satisfying our curiosity about these spectacular events. It has real-world applications that can help us better understand and predict weather patterns, protect our infrastructure, and even safeguard human lives. By monitoring lightning strikes, meteorologists can track the movement of thunderstorms, predict severe weather events like tornadoes and hailstorms, and issue timely warnings to the public. Additionally, understanding the behavior of lightning helps engineers design lightning protection systems for buildings, aircraft, and other critical infrastructure, mitigating the risk of damage and ensuring safety. Seeking shelter, staying safe during thunderstorms. While lightning is a fascinating phenomenon, it also poses a significant danger. 
It's essential to take precautions during thunderstorms to stay safe. When thunder roars, seek immediate shelter indoors or in a hardtop vehicle. Stay away from windows, plumbing and electrical appliances, as these can provide a pathway for lightning to enter a structure. If caught outdoors, avoid open fields, tall trees, water and metal objects, as these can attract lightning. Remember, safety should always be your top priority during a thunderstorm. In conclusion, the enduring allure of atmospheric fireworks. Thunder and lightning, these captivating displays of atmospheric power, continue to fascinate and inspire us. Understanding the science behind these phenomena allows us to appreciate the intricate workings of our planet and the awe-inspiring forces at play in the natural world. By studying lightning, we gain valuable insights into weather patterns, protect our infrastructure and safeguard human lives. So the next time you find yourself mesmerized by the electrifying spectacle of a thunderstorm, remember the science behind the show and appreciate the enduring allure of these atmospheric fireworks. Thanks for watching.